What is up, YouTube? It's your boy Ray, better known as Still Live HD. What I got for you guys today is a Modern Warfare 2 team deathmatch on Storm. I'm gonna be using the Intervention, Sleight of Hand, Stopping Power Ninja Pro, one of my favorite sniper loadouts. And I apologize beforehand. I am sorry for my sniping newbiness. And why is that car revving up so much? It needs to work on that engine. Anyways. So, before I get into anything, I want to thank you guys, you know, for showing me love. For, you know, getting me where I'm at right now. And, you know, just all the positive comments, all the good feedback, the constructive criticism. You know, I'm definitely trying to mold myself into a, a better commentator. And, you know, all the little ideas you guys are giving me, I will definitely try to throw those in to the equation. And, <clears throat> excuse me, my allergies are acting up yet again. Ah, I know, fun time. And a fail. I missed him by like two inches. And he got me. Okay, guys, so, like I said, thank you for everything. Does mean a lot. And messages, guys. Let's talk about messages. You guys have been messaging me, asking me for help or, like, collabo opportunities and things like that. That's all fine and dandy. You know, I try to respond to every message as soon as I get them. <clears throat> but, as some of you know, I have a real crazy work schedule. I could go in and work till 11 at night to come in the next day at 5 in the morning. You know, so, if I don't respond right away to a message, 9 out of 10 times it's because I am trying to catch up on my sleep, and I don't know how I got that quick scope. Let's just thank lag for that. So, I, I try to reply to the messages as soon as I get them. But, you know, I've been getting a lot of them with video replies you know with with videos attached and it's it's all good you know I'll, I'll watch them and all that but it's kind of hard to do that if I'm at work you know so you guys are gonna have to give me some time it might be a day or two so I respond to you but you will get a response you know I try to respond to everyone I've literally I'm only at 170 subs and I spent almost like half an hour replying to all the messages I got now I know if, you know, if God has it in store for me and I become a very big commentator, I know that my time like that's going to be very difficult to answer. You know, all these questions and things like that, you know. But I will definitely be trying my best, you know, to keep up with it. And I want to talk to you guys about what it takes to be a commentator. I had touched up on this on a previous commentary. I'll, I'll attach a link to it below. And it'll be on the screen as well. So, what you gotta do is, in my opinion, well, I talked about, I'm, I'm sorry guys, it's just, uh, I'm still kind of sleepy, <laughs> and I gotta head out to work. Capture card, it, it's all about capture card, video editing software, mic, and here's the thing, you can have the best, the best picture you know i'm talking the best quality ever it doesn't mean jack shit if you're not a good commentator i can't tell you how many people i've watched great quality great gameplay i'm talking these guys are crazy but their personality is what makes it blah and yes i use blah <laughs> so people ask have been asking me what should i do you know how should i be commentating it's hard to be it's hard to stand out nowadays especially with all these people with their personas things like that your best bet would be be yourself just be yourself guys that's probably the most important thing and i think that's what makes a good commentator or a great commentator don't follow the crowd play whatever you want you know like me i my channel is diverse mainly call of duty but I play everything. And, you know, I'm going to be working on a video as well for game reviews and more. Spoiler. And I don't know what it's going to be about, but I'm definitely going to try to get a collabo. If you guys want to do collabos, you know, just let me know. We could do a dual comp. We can do all of that because um, <clears throat> that brings me into more about being a commentator. You know, I'm not going to lie, even sometimes I get a bit nervous doing these commentaries by myself, I'm like, oh, what am I going to talk about? What am I going to talk about? 
Well, if you're having issues, have a friend come over or call somebody over on Skype and do a commentary over that. Just be chill, you know, have fun. You got to be in your comfort zone when you're doing these things. You really have to be in your comfort zone. And patience, guys. It takes a lot of patience, trust me. Like I said, I'm at 170 subs. I can't tell you how long I was like at 30 and 70 subs. I cannot tell you how long. And now this channel got a bit bigger, in my opinion. You know, I'm like super happy about that. You know, so you guys just got to play it out. Think about what you want to do. Try to stand out. Don't, but you got to be yourselves. You know, that's, that's the most important part of it. And quick scope fail. But no, guys, that's pretty much it. You know, I'm going to attach the other video because on this one, I talked about more about being a commentator than what it takes to be a good commentator. You know, uh, that probably doesn't make sense to you guys. Oh, that's pretty much the same thing, right? No, the other one was more about <clears throat> what it would require, you know, like hardware wise. This one's more about personality, things like that. And that's pretty much it, guys. You know, if you guys want to hit me up here on Xbox Live, Skype, or Twitter, feel free to do so. I'll, I'll have links for all of that. And thanks for watching, guys. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Definitely do appreciate the love, guys. Have a good one. Peace.